hey this is Sridhar today I will explain you about how to execute dynamically created delete statement in execute immediate here also I will be explaining without using bind argument and with using bind argument first let me execute without using this bind argument first comes the initialization part my table name is employees and the employee ID is 199 employee name is Douglas the first record of the employees table so going to this data I'm going to delete the first record 199 employee ID is 199 I'm constructing the delete statement dynamically delete from closing the single quotes and my employees table so double pipeline that is concatenating tab variable having employees table closing the single quotes where employee id equals where employee id equals it is coming inside the single quotes again concatenating with the employee id emp id where emp id is 199 i am printing the sql statement and i am executing the sql statement directly here i am not using any bind argument so there is no using class let me execute clear the output it's completed delete from employees table where employee id equals 199 let me check employee 199 is gone now now i am going to uh, uh, in this example I am deleting by putting the where condition as employee ID equals EMP ID but if you are putting where first name equals if you are putting it first name equals then you have to use it differently let me use some other example Jennifer I am going to delete instead of Douglas I am using Jennifer my employee name first name is Jennifer so I'm going to if I want to delete the employee details whose first name equals Jennifer then my SQL statement looks like this one SQL statement equals delete from the table name double pipeline the variable table where first name equals closing the single quotes here for this one first name equals employee name e name so here I am putting two single quotes here and again here four single quotes and the employee name e name Jennifer is substituted here and I am printing the value of SQL statement and I am executing the SQL statement execute immediate SQL statement there is no bind argument here so there is no using class here also sometimes here you, you may be facing some phys difficulty in printing the value if the value is having single quotes if you are searching for a name if you are searching for the name where first name equals if you are putting number so where employee id equals there is no single quotes here so directly you can put it but for the string or where car to variable you may be facing some difficulty in putting the single quotes how many single quotes you want to put like that so for that better use the SQL statement better you can print the SQL statement so you can verify it easily whether your SQL statement is correct or not let me execute this one okay actually there is some constraint here for this record let me do the rollback and I will delete the this record Douglas it's completed I am printing the SQL statement delete from employees where first name equals Douglas. Douglas I am putting inside single quotes. So in this way you can delete the record from a table dynamically and execute it using the execute immediate. 
here I am not using the bind argument my next example is using bind argument but before that let me do the rollback and I am checking it again whether my data is exist because I don't have a I have set some constraint for other records and that's the reason I'm using the same record 199 here I'm going to delete the record whose employee ID is 199 but using the bind argument constructing the SQL statement dynamically delete from the table name which is a variable concatenating the table name again open single quotes where employee ID equals colon 1 so colon 1 is my bind argument so this bind argument will be replaced by the corresponding placeholder value in the execute immediate command execute immediate the SQL statement this SQL statement execute immediate SQL statement using EMP ID what is my EMP ID 199 so I'm going to delete this record from employees table let me execute clear the output it's completed delete from employees where employee ID equals colon 1 colon 1 is employee ID let me check yes record is deleted 199 record is deleted so by this way you can use that delete command also inside the dynamic SQL inside the execute immediate thanks for watching